Hey everyone, welcome back to Canyon Crescent here on the uh, Rimworld. I guess Crescent Canyon, I said that backwards. Um, and we left last time, we were starting to get things in order. We're starting to get some bedrooms built up over here and some stuff like that. We uh, Here is this prisoner. We just released the prisoner because there was no chance of recruiting him and uh, we needed the resources. Sergey is here researching away. Felix here is just coming back really slowly from whatever he was doing to eat himself a meal. And that reminds me, uh, as I was kind of looking around last time, I was noticing Felix was having some problems. And I think what he was getting tired a lot and he was getting kind of hungry a lot. And I think what the problems were stemming from was from the fact that he's just so slow. And so he would maybe be up here and he'd be working and then he would get hungry. And then by the time he got back here, he was just famished or, you know, he'd get tired and go back to his bed. He'd just be exhausted. So all this slow movement, I think, is really bringing Felix down. So what I want to do kind of very first is actually just make an area just for him. So let's go to, I think, restrict, manage areas. We'll make a new area and we'll call it Felix's area. And what we will do is we will set that so that it's going to be just, just right here, you know, maybe up into the, uh, up into the little hospital area, but also there he's eating and the freezer, the food, the dining area, the storage. We'll set that area here for him. So expand allowed areas. There we go. Felix's area. So we want it to include the hospital and I think kind of all of this and there. And let's let him, let's make sure he can play horseshoes. Get, give him some horseshoes as well. And then kind of down around like that. That looks pretty good and actually I think we can probably clear that area for now. Now well, actually what I'd like to do, actually let me put that back. I would like to go ahead and also mine him out a room right here. So unlike them, he's, we're gonna make sure we get him a room that's here in this in this area. Uh, it doesn't be quite that big though. Shrink it down and so we want to make sure he can get into his room as well so expand Felix's area so it covers his room and let's go ahead actually also just for speediness we should put a door right here it just makes sense people can get it in and out all right we've got some cargo pods we'll check that in a minute but the idea is we'll make this this is kind of the central area I'll make sure Felix doesn't have to really leave this area he's not gonna be wandering kind of way out getting this cargo whatever it might happen to be uh, what is it it is Wart. What is wart? Beer before fermentation. Uh, I guess we will freeze it. I mean, we might well take it, I guess. We'll freeze it. Make sure that this is set to where it can hang on to it. Yeah, okay, so um, raw, is it raw food? Or raw resources, maybe? No? I mean, it's going to be, is it, there it is, it's a drug. So let's go ahead and, and click that there as well. Okay, very good, very good. So someday somebody will go and, and, and move that stuff over. Not too worried about that right now. And okay, so John's bedroom is about built. Um, this bedroom is built. We could actually give this to somebody who has a really good bed. So I'm going to see, and John here has an awful bed. I'm not actually sure what contributes to impressiveness, but we're going to want to try to make this as a really good room. This is awful. Who has a good bed? So, oh, uh, Kirill has a superior bed. So we will make this be Kirill's room here. So in the morning he can move over there. We're going to need some lights in here as well, aren't we? Um, so furniture, lamps, boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. All right, let's get built. And the other thing that was going on is John kept getting cold. So I think what we need to do is we need to make a, a toque for him. We got lots of material. 
So we'll make a tailoring bench. Where's a good place to put it? Uh, I don't. Ah, gosh, I don't. I'm not sure where the best place to put it is. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll just put it right there for now. It's not going to hurt anything to have it there. We'll speed things up, and then once we get that built, we'll let somebody go ahead and, and make John a toque. See if that helps. But he's just going to be cooking, building up the meals. Um, Sergey, he's doing some building. Felix, all right. Actually, we have to restrict Felix now. We've made him an area, but we got to make sure he's in that area. And John, why is John on Joy all the time? I guess he needs it. He's got, yeah, oh, his his pet died and he's, yeah. Okay, so also these complaints about things being ugly. John, minor break risk, needs, he's got tons of Joy, but a cold, yeah, that cold is really going to hurt, I think, so. Um, also, we can give him his own bedroom once we get this bed built and these walls built here. Right, so we've got one here. Sergey, good job. Nice work, sir. Um, we will make this for uh, Sam. That should be good. A pack, pack of man-hunting rhinoceroses have entered the area. They will roam the region hunting for humanoid flesh. They can't pass doors. If you stay behind walls, you should be safe. They won't attack inactive turrets. Turn your turrets off if you want to save them. They'll leave the area in a few days. Okay. Uh, where are they? Okay, they're way up here. There's just two of them. I don't think I want to tackle with a pair of rhinoceroses. I don't, I don't think we are up to that yet. So let's actually um, build a couple of doors. Uh, structure. Not enough stored. What do we have stored? All right, well, we've got steel, I, and I'm in a hurry, so we're just going to do this. Uh, Sergey, you make that right there, and Sam, are you buildable? Oh, Sergey's doing that one as well. So you guys get that built, and then, actually, where was that pot, that that stuff that 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 cargo drop we had? Because I don't want them going out after it. I don't really need beer that bad right now uh, oh here it is so I'm gonna go ahead and forbid that maybe it'll go bad I don't care I'm not risking rhinoceroses uh, to I'm not gonna risk rhinoceroses ooh I thought are they gonna break the door down they are gonna break the door down they, they, they lied to me they said that they weren't gonna Ugh. okay all right everybody It's go time. Um, where are the best places to put you guys? I don't know. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, Felix. I don't know if cover is going to matter, to be honest. I'm not sure cover is going to matter a whole lot, so we're... I'm just going to get you guys in a big firing line. Hope that you can get there. Alright, can we do this? Can we do this? The rhinoceros is... Oh, you know what? Shoot, I should have... I should have grabbed the grenades. We've got some grenades. Yeah, we do. Too late now. Alright, one of them's dead. Okay, awesome. Sergey, how you doing? Oh, we did it! Ha ha ha, nice work! Sergey, sorry about the pain. Um, all you guys, undraft. I can't believe the tooltip lied to me. It said they wouldn't go through doors. Or did I misread that? I should go back and look again, I guess. But, okay, Sergey, go get yourself patched up. Um, yeah, we've got... Uh, rhinoceros parts that we can move around. Um, Felix, where are you going? Are you going? You're going to freeze it, right? Oh, and you know what? Kiro keeps using up all our good 
all our good material making bills. So let's suspend this for now. Of course, Kirill's got nothing to do, but, but we're just losing all our material because he keeps uh, making... Wait. A grizzly bear has become tame? Can you train a grizzly bear? <laughs> I can train a grizzly bear! Um, what? You know, I mean, uh, oh. But there's no... Yeah. I can train a grizzly bear. That's amazing! Alright, where is this grizzly bear gonna live? Um... Oh, but man, what a fantastic... Fantastic thing to, to have on your side. <laughs> Alright, so we just got a ton of rhinoceros meat. And... Maybe we'll do a haul on potatoes, cooking a meal, tending to Sergey. Good call, good call. He's doing some research now. Okay, all right. Car uh, Carol, can you go train him? Maybe, I don't know, is there like a, a level that's needed? Where'd that grizzly bear go? Where's my grizzly bear? So over here. Uh, minimum handling skill. Six. Carol, you've got... Uh, four. What does anyone have a... Oh, John does. John's got an 11. So let's... Uh, actually, yeah, John, you go ahead and... and uh, go ahead for... And see if we can train that grizzly bear up a little bit. Now, is there a reason no one's hauling that rhinoceros around? Someone should be doing that as well. Uh, Felix? Actually, you're going to want to have some dinner here and sleep soon. John, you want to... Actually, you want to... um. Move that, get it frozen. Train the grizzly bear doesn't have to happen tonight, but uh, let's go ahead. Also, animals, animal area. Let's do make an animal area for right now, um, just for our grizzly bear to be in, so he's not wandering around. And animal area. Yeah, it's not set. Let's set it for. Right here. And then let's go ahead and. Ha yeah, how the grizzly bear you should be in the animal area. Now, I hope that train the grizzly bear doesn't uh, cause problems, but. Alright, how's your health anyway? You. Your consciousness is weakened and manipulation is weakened. You're at 80% and 92. Ah! That's not so bad. That's not so bad. Um, look, that's not animal area one you're in, Grizzly. Oh man, I don't know how I feel about having a Grizzly just kind of wandering around here. What's Felix doing? Just moving some cloth. Alright, let's speed things up. You guys. Oh, some travelers. Do they have anything to trade? Nah, they just pass. Uh, you guys, I don't care about you. Everyone else, go to bed. Have a good night. We'll see you in the morning. All right. Sergey was healed in the middle of the night, it said. Uh, people are up and going to work. Uh, John. Yeah, you, someone someone took off their shirt at some point. Um, let's see. All right, you know what? What's This is a rat. I'm just curious. The training... Minimum handling skill is three, so we're going to just try training the rat so that Kirill has something to do. Because otherwise Kirill's got nothing to do. And hopefully that will uh, raise his skill in training, so eventually he can be the animal handler if he gets up to six or whatever the grizzly needs. And yeah, there's the grizzly, just want to wander around. I hope I give him a big enough area. I don't know a whole lot about handling grizzlies. It's not really something that you know has happened a lot in my life that I've had grizzlies to be handling. But uh, how's everyone doing? So needs. Oh, Sam's jealous. Who has a more impressive bedroom than you? 
So you've got nine. It's an impressive. So minus ten. That's a three. Why? All right. Uh, fine. Fine. Let's just switch. I'm just gonna switch. This is now Sam's room. And Kiro, this is now your room. And actually, this can go ahead. Uh, this is a room. This can go ahead and be Sergey's room. I don't know what he keeps getting a little bit unhappy. Um, you have his own, yeah, have his own bedroom, and so we can give I guess this one to John, and then these will just be two extras once they're all said and done. So we'll get back to work. And what's Felix up to? He's relaxing socially. That's probably good. He's gotta you know, he's gotta have things to do. But I think yeah, I think actually. Oh, you know what? I had forgotten. Sam, why are you going to have a minor break risk? You're still jealous. Well, that's... You have the most... Someone else have a more impressive bedroom than three? Oh, yeah, Sergey does. This is a 15. How on earth? All right, fine. All right, Sam, that's yours. And Sergey, that's yours. All right. And Sam, feeling better now? All right. Jeez, some people. Okay, now we also need to, it's annoying, we need to start making this stuff look nice. The bedrooms we should definitely make look nice because they look kind of really dumpy, but, um, oh, it's pretty hot out here too. You know what, we better cool down these bedrooms. So let's go ahead and put in, uh, a cooler here and here and then vents I think there and there I think I'm hoping that will uh, keep everything nice and cool and I'm a little worried about power maybe I should put in a second battery just so we can store up a bit more uh, but we are running low on um, with John does John not have a room John doesn't have a room either. Oh, John will when this is done. That's right. We just got to get that done. All right. But yeah, we need some more, um, not iron, steel. So let's actually go ahead and uh, expand this out a little bit more for where Felix can go. So Felix, yeah, you can go there already. Let's do that as well. And then I forgot, but... I had a request. There's a little room over here, and I had a request that I go ahead and uh, mine out that room as well. So, Felix, yeah, you're doing some hauling, which is fine, but I think actually I'd like you to prioritize the mining. And also after that, you can start mining some of this, uh, some of this steel too, because we need that. And oh, and some gold. That wouldn't be a terrible thing. But start with the. No, no, Felix. I said prioritize the mining. I really, in fact, you know what, Felix? Let's. Uh... Where are you? There you are. Put you on mining. All right, Kirill, you just being bored again? Yeah, I don't know what to do, but you're wasting all of our resources doing that, so you're just gonna have to be bored for a bit. So John's unhappy now. Why is John unhappy? Hot, shared bedroom, all that kind of stuff. All right, you know what? We need some, somebody needs to chop down some wood. Maybe all this wood in Kirill's bedroom doesn't need to be there. And then we'll have something we can build you know what? Actually, I don't even need to build a bed here. What am I thinking? I can just move one of these beds. So, just reinstall that right here. And as soon as that is done, then we can give that to John. John will have a room. That should help him be a little faster. Felix is here chopping. And who's at risk of a break? John still. Um, sh yeah, okay. Uh, is that bedroom? Okay, that bedroom's right there. So let's go ahead and assign 
this to John. And let's see, does that make him feel any better? Oh, and there's no power to this. Um, that's interesting. Yes. All right. I think that should probably make it okay. And we'll have the same problem over here, won't we? So let's try that. And everyone's sleeping. Let's just while they're sleeping, let's check their uh, needs real quick. So Sergei's joy deprived. I think he can get over that with little horseshoes in the mor morning. Um, Kirill, yeah, you're fine. So Felix is in pain, an ugly environment. That's unfortunate. And I think he is kind of stuck over here. So let's, uh, well, I do want to get this, this room opened up because I did have the request to do that. So let's try to focus on that first and foremost. Once that's been taken care of, then maybe we'll see if Felix can focus on building this uh, bench here. And actually, we can do this. We can build that bench, I think, uh, production out of, um, not put your table, where is it? Hand tailing bench. Uh, Oh, no, we can't. We can't. I thought maybe we could build it out of blocks, because we do have some blocks sitting around, but we can't do that. So, let's move it to there. Oh, Felix, you're so slow. I'm so sorry, man. But this just should be it. All right, big money, big money. What do we got in our room? <laughs> Nothing. Just that little thing right there. But that's okay. Uh, and, okay, Felix is going to work on his room. Now, what we also want to do here, I think we want to smooth these floors, because Felix needs a nice place to live as well. And smooth the floors look nice, and then we can go ahead and um, put some wood floor in here. And actually, we could go ahead... Uh, well, no, I didn't quite do that right. That storage area is just right there. We could pull this, so this is not a storage area. I'll put a wall right across here. And that I think would look would look uh, nice, and then we could kind of carve out this little area as well, and we would have kind of a nice like a dining room area in here. We could turn this into a dining room. I think that would be a good good idea, because everybody has a bedroom now. I think. Oh, and they're having a party, and that is such a good idea. Who did it? John throwing a party? That's excellent, excellent idea, John. How's everyone doing? Um, I don't know why Sam without a table. We've, we've got a table. We've, oh, you know what? We don't have enough chairs for everybody, do we? Um, John's in a little pain. He's still upset about his animal. Ugly environment. That's our next job, is to make the environment be not so ugly. <laughs> Kirill's doing great, because, you know, what does he have to do? And Sergey, he's feeling bad, but, but you know, other than that, yeah, everyone's doing, doing pretty much okay, I think. I think we are... You know, really starting to make it. It's starting to work. So go ahead and sleep, guys. We'll see you in the morning. And we're all up and at them. Here we go. John and Felix are sleeping in, it looks like, but that's totally okay. Kirill's... Oh, he's teaming the rat. Yep. If he ever does that. Let's actually look how he's doing. All right. He's uh, about almost halfway to the next level. So that's all right. Uh... Bear, I think, is still... Oh, he... he Okay. He can be assigned a master. He will follow it and defend it. Um, next thing we can do is get him so we can actually like send him to attack people who are attacking us, which is awesome. I mean, that's... Yeah, that's going to be fantastic. Um, but yeah, let's see. Oh, we need some more wood. We are short on wood. And I've... I don't, are we out of... Are we out of uh, steel as well? We sure might be. Yeah, that would explain why that stuff's not getting built. So let's actually do this. Let's come over and um, do some mining because we need that steel there. And let's have Felix actually prioritize mining for right now. Is that we need to get that done? 
And let's go ahead also and designate some um, wood to get chopped down. That's got to get done. Now who's going to be chopping our wood? So we have 92 meals actually. I think we could go ahead and probably suspend this bill for now. Um, John's going to do a good job of that. And then John, yeah, he's doing some butchering which is fine. That's got to get done. Uh, but then he's gonna go sleep. It's another another day. But then um, he can start working on what does John do when he's done cooking? Hunting, not so much. Handling, yeah, we'll, we'll keep him on on handling. But he's gonna do it all the time. He can start actually. Well, some, yeah, I'll start calling and cleaning, which is really good. Uh, Sir guy, Sir Sir guy, is our best tailor. So once we get this this thing built, we'll have Sir guy, Sergei, Sergei, Sergei. Still don't know how I want to say it. We'll have him build that. But for now, we'll just sleep and get back in the morning. All right, middle of the night cargo pods. Let's see what we've got this time. We have got potatoes. I mean, I'm not going to say no, you know. John's viewing some art. These guys are still sleeping. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my. Felix is going to put stuff on fire? Um, he says that. I don't see him doing it, but, uh, all right. People go put it out. All right. We just got to make sure all the fires are in the home area. Actually, he's limited to the home area. He can't really go a whole lot of places, so we should be able to keep on this. Um, but yeah, he's, this is gonna, this is gonna drive everyone nuts. He's running around starting fires. He's our pyromaniac. So I guess it's over. The spree's over. So now he's gonna have some breakfast and that was weird. It wasn't like a break or anything. It wasn't like his, his, you know, needs kind of got really bad or anything. He just did it. But he got, all right, he got a 25, you know, buff for, for that. I guess it was probably worth it. Now, Felix, I really, I'm sorry, I really, wait, he's doing it again? He just did that, all right. Felix, ah, Felix, you know, I'm sorry, I feel bad for you and all, man, but this is not okay. Good thing Kirill's here, I mean, Kirill's got nothing else to do, just follow Felix around and put out his fires, you know, literally. Um, jeez, okay. You know what? We should probably actually go ahead and chop down these bits of wood. Alright. Oh, Felix, 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 Felix. Alright, he's no longer... Gonna, he better be, like, incredibly happy. Oh, no, he doesn't. They don't stack. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, you know, here we are. So, I think here it is, another night, going to bed. I suspect these potatoes, I think they were over here they dropped, probably aren't going to get gathered before they go bad, because we've got too much else going on. Um, but, you know, we're doing pretty good. We've got a lot of raw food, almost 100 meals, and these guys all have bedrooms of their own. Felix doesn't yet have a bedroom of his own, but he's, you know, getting close. We're going to need to get this mined out. Now, I think my next pr two priorities, I'll say, as I finish up here today, my next two priorities are going to be, um, one is just making things look nice. Now, I know there's lots more we got to get done, but I think until we have kind of a pretty place, a place that people want to be, uh, we're not going to really benefit from, you know, uh, starting to build lots more stuff. The research is almost done for stone cutting. When that's finished, we can start into microelectronics. That'll be really good as well. The other thing I really want to do is I want to expand this. Now, a pistol, that's our shortest range weapon, has, pause it for a second so I don't start building this, but it has a um, distance of 24. So that's actually all the way out to here. So I think what I want to do is kind of expand this out so it's like this and make it out of stone. So we'll have to like get that stone cutting started and all that. And it's kind of go all the way back here, of course. And that way, they've got a little more range, and I can also put more people. And if we get more people in our colony, we'll have more spots for people to kind of sit and fire from. So I want to do that. That's definitely on my to-do list. 
uh, of, of tasks. But I think we also want to make things look nice, especially for Felix. We want to keep him from having any more of these kind of breaks going on. Um, but yeah, but that's going to be it for today. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I know I sure did, and I will see you next time.